Hi guys, I'm Kristen and you're watching Perfect Fitness TV. So today I've got another Tabata workout for you. So it's four exercises done in four minutes of work, okay? So just check out the moves and then I'll break it down for you. Okay guys, so I've just finished my first round of this workout, so let me break it down for you. <sighs> it's really nice because this one's um, a little bit not as high intensity, okay? So it's still a Tabata, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, but it's not as explosive as the other ones. It's much more about the conditioning aspect of the workout, okay? So you're going to start with a reverse lunge to a knee hop, and if you're not jumping, you can just take the knee up, okay? So you have lunge back. Drive the knee forward and jump up. So lunge back and up. So you stay on the same leg, 
for the whole first set. And up, and up. And if you're not jumping, just drive the knee up. You come down for exercise two after your 10 second break, hit the plank position, knees up and you twist your knee to the opposite shoulder. Twist, 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 okay? So that is your first minute done. For the second minute, you come back, the lunges on the other leg, okay? So make sure you change legs. And you lunge back, come up and jump, up and jump. And then you go back to the mat to repeat exercise two, plank with the knee twist. Okay, so that's two minutes done. Moving on to minute three. And exercise three, you have a three pull squat jump and you change corner to corner. So you have three, two, one, down and jump. Three, two, one, down and jump. As you're taking those little squeezes, make it small, make it an inch. Make sure you're driving through those heels, pressing the knees out, really squeeze here. Three, two, one, down and jump, okay? If you're not jumping, three, two, one, down and lift. Three, two, one, down and lift, okay? Not a problem if you're a non-jumper. Then we come down to the mat. Now this is the really challenging one here, is the reverse plank tricep dips. So these are difficult. If you have weak wrists, I don't recommend this one. You would bend your knees and take the normal tricep dips or you'd keep your hips on the ground, you'd bend the elbows and then press up. If you want to, you could even put a little um, pillow kind of underneath your wrist to help you, um, that's on an angle to help you get rid of the, the angle of the wrist. But if you want to feel this in the triceps, really long plank position, keep your hips up, try not to let it sink, keep that nice and straight. And you bend the elbows down and up. It won't feel like you're going far, but man, after that 20 seconds, you'll get about good 12 reps in. You will feel your triceps. You repeat those two exercises again, then you have a minute to recover, and that's where you can take that tricep stretch. And boy, I really, I'm so glad I put this stretch in because your triceps are really feeling it, okay? And you have a minute to take the stretch. Then you repeat this whole workout two more times so it's a 15 minute, uh, 15 minute Tabata workout, okay? So set your timer, so 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest for eight rounds, okay? So it'll be four minutes and then you just take a minute to recover and you start it again. And that's it. So uh, let me know what you think of the workout. If you like the music and need a timer, you can get those on the links below. Um, subscribe to the workout as well, uh, to the channel for your weekly workouts Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays with me. And um, Thanks for watching. I'm Kristen and this is Perfect Fit.